Have you heard or not? Yes, sir. The flaps come into this category. Yes, sir. High lifting devices. Yes, sir. Is there any other thing also comes into this category? High lifting devices? Slab. I am saying high lifting devices. At the time of takeoff, we need more lift. This we have agreed. Is it it? So slats, what you are saying is here, isn't it? So this slat will extend something like this. There will be gap gap created. There will be gap created this much for the flow to pass. Isn't it? If flow is coming like this. It will pass. If you are so generally flaps are extended. We agree with this. Flaps are moved down, isn't it? Whereas slat is extended forward so that it creates a gap. Is everybody clear? And this coming to the flap, if you are deflecting with delta f, you will get your lift curve slow with this. This is your wing only. This is width. Width plus flap. Is it clear? I hope you know this already. And you extend both. You deflect flap, you extend slab. So what will happen? This graph will extend further. Isn't it? So there is this much extra effect of slant. Isn't it? So what is the advantage? If you see stall, isn't it? This is your alpha stall. Now when you are deflecting flap, your alpha stall is decreasing, which is dangerous. Your aircraft can stall at lower angle of attack. So I can avoid this using this slab. Isn't it? So I have this, if it is 0, this is 1, let's say this is 2. So I am able to get more lift as well as more alpha stop. Isn't it? So in next task, we will, in your solid works, you already have the air files with you, air file coordinates. You have to split your airfoil into flap and into the main airfoil body and slab. Isn't it? Now to make this, where will you cut this? This is your CF, cord length of this flap. Whereas this is the overall cord length. Isn't it? Now this ratio Cord of flap by cord of airfoil, you can take from 0 0.25. Last quarter portion of the airfoil, you can take as a flap. Is it clear? How will you make flap? Clear? Now, 
let me write what are different types of flash. One is your plain flap. There is split flap. We have slip flap. Then Fowler flap. But before Fowler flap, what should be there? Have you heard of slotted flap? Okay. Have you heard of double <coughs> slotted flap? Isn't it? Now plain flap. If you have your simple hair foil, you are just cutting hair like this so that it rotates like this. How split, split flap will look like? You again have seen. Now what you are doing, you are cutting this. Okay. And this much portion, you can deflect down. Okay. So this will be your deflection. Before forward flap, let's say slotted flap. So what happens? <coughs> this plain flap inside there is a slot. Okay. Then the double slotted flap. You have double slot. What happens? Now this slot is in terms of shape S. Okay. So that when you extend, okay, so this portion will be reflected like this. So there will be gaps. What about Fowler flap? So this double flap, uh, slotted flap, it can become Fowler flap. When it is extended, so this extends up to this much, then this. Further extends. Actually, they are moving back. They move back. Okay. So there is this much extra part that is added. Wait, is it clear?